Hello everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to some more Ruby visual novel with me. And yeah, so we're doing Penny State today. I said I would. It's the third day of four dates, and uh, yeah, it's, it's Penny's turn. I don't really know why I, I picked the particular order I did. I just went with Ravens first because it did, and then it just kind of went from there. But yeah, we get Penny going third, then Ravens fourth day uh, going last. So. I don't really know what to expect from this. I'm quite I'm concerned, sort of. Because, right, how the dates seem to go, well, I don't know if there's any distinct pattern, but basically, if things start off fun, it then gets super serious and fugsy by the end. If it starts off super serious -y, sort of-y, at the start, it ends up becoming funner by the end. That seems to be sort of the pattern that goes. <laughs> I don't know. Like, Blake's one starts off more funsy and then gets... Man, well, actually, no, Blake's one starts seriously with murder, then gets fun, then gets serious again. With Adam lynching us in a tree. Um, then, yeah, like, Winter's one starts off sort of funsy. With her sitting on his morning press, uh, press ups to then her torturing us. Just... Yeah, but then Raven's one starts off all serious with the thing between her and Yang, and then devolves into whatever the hell the third date was. <laughs> so Penny's one started off with a kissing match. I think. Was that the first one? Is this the third one? Is this the fourth one? I don't know. I forget where we're at with Penny. But anyway, after that, then we got to see Penny in her, like, recharge outfit. That was good. But, uh, then it got up my series because Penny was worried about the other person inside her. And I'm scared that it's going to get fuelsy for Penny, so... <laughs> I don't know what to expect clicking this. My name is Penny Paul, and yeah, I feel like we're getting seriously. Oh, let's start. Let's see if it, let's, let's see what this is in. My name is Penny Polandina. As far as anyone knows, there's only one of me. Yeah, you're the you're only one of your kind. Unless you count CL in this game. That, that's not how you pronounce the name, but it's how I pronounce it. I mean, there is. There is only one Penny. But Penny is made up of more than just the Penny people see. Okay. When I was born, it was a complete surprise. My father hadn't been actively looking to create me. As an unexpected miracle, a byproduct of an experiment in the properties of dust crystals. Sure. I love it, by the way. Okay, so this game getting made was well before... Like, I don't know if it was around season... Like, but after... It was after season three. I know that. Uh, but I don't know when exactly this game started getting made. But I know it's it, maybe around season four-ish or something. I don't know the exact dates or whatever. All I know is that basically... This game started before a lot of details for Ruby came out. So because the game didn't have Ruby's actual plot to follow, it just sort of made its own up from stuff. So it made some assumptions in terms of like how, you know, certain things came about. Obviously at this point we now have a bit, a, a bit of a better idea of how Penny came to be. But I mean, if the game is to follow, that's one of those ones. So yeah, don't be surprised if some stuff doesn't line up with actual Ruby canon. It's just the story just had its own plan and... This is where it's ending up, and some of it might fall canon some of it might fall this game's own kind of, it, the canon is built itself, you know? Anyway, a newborn soul trapped in such a small core, without any ability to interact with the world or learn. As special as my existence was, I would have had the same life as of a plant, or a particular precious paperweight. <laughs> okay! I was explaining that. So my father decided he would build me a real body, but there was a problem with that plan. Penny, there you are. It's New Evelyn. Yeah, that's an art, like, when we do dates, it's always a 50-50 of is it going to be Old Evelyn or New Evelyn. It really depends on the lineup. I think all the newer dates now should have, all have New Evelyn because they all take place later in the game. I don't know. Anyway, where do you disappear to after lessons were over? Oh, Evelyn, I'm sorry. It's just, I wasn't really hungry. You don't eat. Penny, you're never hungry. What's wrong? Like, you're never hungry, you just come for the company, right? I wanted some time to myself to think. Did... did something happen? Nothing yet, just... I recently had to face a situation that so far, I'd always been shielded from. And yet, all I can do is ignore and repress it. There's no cure, just caution, and yet... Does... does it... This have to do with that checkup Jane accompanied, uh, accompanied you to? In a way, but please don't. I've told him that everything was fine. Penny, you can't be doing this! 
we've dealt with Evelyn having a tortured insane thingy we jigging going off and <laughs> our hearts can't handle this again, Penny, damn it. Then something is wrong. No. I mean, yes, I uh this is so illogical. Are you in danger? No. That's good. Then try and explain what's bothering you. There's something about me that it's been with me for as long as I can remember, and it still keeps on being so forever. I I got used to thinking of it as an ally, something useful, but now I've recently re uh, realized it may be harmful and I will have to learn to live with it. Sounds familiar. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess if anyone would know how that feels like it'd be a lot, how that feels like it'd be you. Yeah, so don't make my same mistake. Don't be a martyr. Don't think that you have to keep your problems from us. If something's wrong, just tell us. She knows from experience, damn it. We had to go through a really dangerous forest to save our forest that I've revisited about a dozen times at this point. I never want to go back to the brutal forest. Oh god, I've literally, I, I've had to do that scene so many times to get to certain date setups that <laughs> I'm sick of that forest. I've done that, I've done that event so many times. It's it's not exactly a short event, like you can speed through it, but it still takes a bit of time. You still got to actually pay attention to what you're doing. It's not super hard when you know what to do, but you still got to pay <laughs> Bloody brutal forest. I'll show everyone for to me in this way. I survived. We survived because we have a lot of friends and we kicked some considerable ass, but... There was no small amount of luck involved. True. And remembering the way I felt at Burrito, I... There's no way I could ever willingly put anyone through that myself. Didn't Jin nearly kill himself for that process? Pretty sure he nearly died trying to save Evelyn. That was a thing. And Jack completely wrecked her body. That was another thing. Anyway, good. Yes, good. Do you... Do you want some company while thinking? What about lunch? We'll leave the moment my stomach starts grumbling, I promise. Yay! I feel seen without gin. Has that ever happened before? <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, no. Okay. No. Technically, there's been lots of scenes that have not actually technically included it. I did, for example, license a uh, thingy together. But, like, this is one where Jin wasn't even the main tub subject of conversation. Madness! Nah, there's, been lo there's been lots of scenes like that, it's fine. Anyway, my name is Penny Blandina, part two. And, no, we'll ignore Cinder for now. Penny, what's your next thing? Apparently, you go to the bedroom next. You know who could have a body? I wouldn't know how to use it. Humans and animals, they're born with the uh, uh, instinctual knowledge as to how to move the bodies they're born with. They develop and experiment as, as their bodies grow and develop. But human babies don't need to learn how to breathe or to make blood, thrown, uh, blo uh, make blood flow in their veins. You don't have blood, Penny. I don't see the problem here. Nor do you even need to breathe. Do you need to breathe? I don't know about that one either. I have to breathe just to look, you know, just to look the part. But that's a bit... I could learn. Where there's an un uh, our conscience, there's a way to communicate. But again... I would need a body that I didn't know how to use for that. So, my father also created someone who could operate the body for me while I learned, while he studied. The other penny. My machine inside, as I put it to Jin. Okay, so it's like an operating system thing inside her. It's, like, it's basically doing what... I don't even know how to describe this. <laughs> it's just making sure all the background stuff keeps going in the background to keep everything functioning and flowing as it should. Yes! Yes, okay, sure, let's go with that. Because I don't know what I'm talking about. So that's the outfit Jim was talking about. Well, it's not really an outfit, is it? Oh, it's definitely an outfit. Oh, god damn it, why are you in your maid costume? <laughs> I'm gonna, I prefer Jack's casual clothes to our maid costume, to be fair. But it, whatever. It's what you wear underneath. Now I understand why it got him so flustered. Hey, yeah. When he first saw it, he... Had a reaction. Oh, Penny, we all did. When does he not? Anyway. He told me that it doubles as a morning system of sorts. Are you have... Uh, 
Are you okay? It's not me going mental there. Are you have having? Are you having any trouble adjusting to your new body? It's not me having there. Oh no, I'm fine. It's just for Papa and my very existence is uncharted territory. So the more data he has, the better he can work. Correct me if I'm wrong, but isn't that also the purpose of your weekly Saturday checkups? Well, yes, but 24/7 coverage also allows a much larger wealth of that. 24/7 coverage, Penny. You got to do all sorts of things at 24/7 hours. What? Or maybe your father's just worried about you. Could be that too. Uh, I guess he could have been. Yes, but no, but silly. I guess there's still something you have to get used to. Let's say, okay, the analogy is terrible, but you know how a towel can be used for a lot of things? It's intended use to depends on the need of the moment of the buy. I struggle with that sense there. Um, yes. Okay. Believe me when I say that Mr. Polandina seems his primary role as being a father, not being a scientist. But science is... Research is his profession. It's his whole life. Until he got a daughter! Are you sure that is not something else now? I... I don't really... Of course your birth was probably different from normal humans, but... He's not the one who chose to call himself your father. That's true. You could have been anything to him. You could have just been a research subject. You could have been a nothing. Instead, he made you his daughter. He had feelings attached to it. He named you and blah, 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 blah. And there's a lot of meaning behind that word than simply DNA donor. Keep that in mind. What was your father like, Jack? I'm trying to remember Jack's family stuff. It's been so long since we've ever mentioned them. <laughs> My dad was the best. One time he... Okay, we have to hear this. This is fine. Right! Okay, so we've done... The bugger is this! Aha! Uh -huh, found you. Also, what's this? Maybe on a cafe? That's... 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 White Rose. Madonna. Alright, it's here I met her last time. Who the hell is this? Ah, it's Pierre's thing. Okay. I forget all these events. It's been a while. My name is Penny Pondina, part three. Alright, so she's done a wee thing with Evelyn. She's done a wee thing with Jack. Is this the one she does with Jin, or is it gonna be Ruby, or is it just gonna be her herself, or with her father, or... Place your bets! My father never really gave it a real name. What he envisioned was a, a sentient version of an atomic nervous system. So the first six months of my life, all I did was lay down. At first as a core. Then inside a machine body, while my father tried to find a way to make me interact with the world. Then my father finally found a way to communicate with me. He found a way to really talk to me, to teach and make me learn, and to make me interact with this body. On the eve of the seventh month, I could see. On the eighth, I could sit. Then I could learn to speak, and so on. I could do all these, uh, all this because Machine Penny was there to help make the task easier. Still, I've uh, eventually even learned to replicate her functions. What then? Father gave me my first choice. Oh wow, Fire Dust price has gone up. Yeah, everyone keeps stealing it, Ribby. It's everyone's favorite. It causes explosions, or uh, fire, uh, fire explosions. Yay! And I decided that I didn't want her to disappear. I wanted to give her a new function, and the occasion came when I discovered my semblance. What's Penny's semblance again? Oh, she shits lasers and stuff, and that's built into her though. I can't remember if it said that in Season 7. It has? Yeah. Periodically for a time now. Seems like Atlas has been sending smaller and smaller shipments. Hmm. It is weird. Maybe there's a sudden shortage or problems with acquiring supply. Although I haven't heard of such a thing. It's because people are stealing it all! Don't you just read the news? Or maybe the store owner is biased against you because you owe him a truck. Could be that too, the old man works everywhere. <laughs> that was actually a good joke. Great job, Penny. I like my laugh, that wasn't good. Ah, uh, it wasn't that eff uh, efficient. No, I swear. You've come along. Uh, you've come so far since we first met. 
I have, haven't I? Well, consider that your original idea of having a friend seemed to come out of a TV show. Now you've grown confident enough to use self-deprecating humour. You go, girl. I guess that placing myself in an uncontrolled environment is what made the chance possible. Change possible. If I'd kept to only being able to interact with people for a minute at a time, I'd have never been able to learn. Yeah. Like, I don't know much about the Atlas army, but you can't get more controlled than the military, can you? Indeed. But to secure, uh, to secure funding needed for my girls, Papa had no choice but to register me as a command, uh, combatant. It took a while to convince General Ironwood to allow me to even travel with him to Bill. And he definitely didn't expect Jin. Nobody expected Jin. Nobody ever expects Jin. <laughs> Glenda Goodrich won't be expecting Jim when it's her turn. Hey, pfft. Who could have expected old Crater Face? Oh. But Jin doesn't have, uh, seem to have acne problems. Do you know something about his skin condition? I don't. Sigh. Penny, there's no psych. Gotcha. She's been hanging around with Evelyn too long. Oh my god! I need to get used to this! I'm not doing laughs. I can't do laughs! It doesn't work out very well. Let's say you met me at a very strange time in my life, Ruby. No. I'm getting over it now. Promise to never get over me. Oh, she's getting... I, was, I, I just lost all sense of what was going on there. Wait, no, she's getting over her thing. The hell? What do you want? I ain't clicking you. Must have clicked really quick. There's a fourth one. Is it now Jin's turn? It could be. This will probably be the last one. They'll be going to the day, I imagine. My semblance. Papa immediately saw his potential. He saw that one day... I could save the world with it, but he also realised that it's too powerful for me to control right now. It will take me years to properly harness it. But the machine me could harness it without trouble, with it, uh, which is how Senza Fili was born, and why my semblance is locked behind its usage, to properly utilise it. What, like kill mode? What? But also, to give Machine Penny the side of me I literally wouldn't exist as Penny without it. A function past the ones I've taken over. But now I've realised how foolish we were. Her function was doing things I couldn't. And now we told her that her her function is doing things in my place because she can do them better. Oh, yeah, because she wants full control. I think I remember this conversation. So, not that I mind, but what brought this on? Yay, it's Jin's turn! I mean, can you technically just download dancing instructions or something if you wanted to learn before the vital dance? Is this the third or fourth date with Penny? I generally don't know. Hmm. I'm not sure. Was it kissing one date two or date one? I have to look into this. I generally forget. This might be the fourth date. I'm not even sure. If it is Penny's fourth date, that's of interest. Hmm. Anyway, but oh. I could indeed, but... Oh, come on, Jane, this is more fun. Plus, you might as well learn how to dance. I thought it'd be nicer if I learned together with you. You're adorable. And technically, she could be. She could be better than me. A better me in everything I do. So there's only one solution. One way to never let her want to take over. Make her lose the will to fight. Why is in uh why in the gardens though? Other than being really romantic. It it was just because there's more space, but Yes, this is kind of romantic. Or maybe you just want the excuse to spend some alone time? Maybe. It's kind of like a date thing. <laughs> Become a better and better me. Become the best penny I can. The best version of Penny that can ever exist. Someone with lots of friends. Someone Papa can be proud of. Skilled enough to protect anyone. Strong enough to defeat any opponent. And save Remnant. Eh, I'm sure you'll be fine. It's went pink! It's kissing! And... Hello! I wasn't expecting this! 
I thought we were doing a date thing. This is a date though, kind of, because we're doing a garden thingy. Strong enough to never, ever let you go. Well, this was nice. I was expecting a much nastier turn. Calculating! Calculating! The hell! Error! Penny, please don't stab me. Okay, I may have spoke too soon. Running for their simulations. Results are inconclusive. Alright then! <laughs> okay! That's got me a bit worried! That was Penny's fourth date thing. Okay, this has been interesting. So that's Raven. Two of Ravens, actually. Two of Ravens' three dates have not took place. Oh, okay, no. Raven's first date is intimately tied. It's intimately. It's, it's tied in with Yang's fourth date. So you get Raven's first date by doing Yang's fourth or third. I forget which one it is. It's one of those. Uh, yeah, you do one of Yang's dates, and it unlocks Raven. So long as you've done enough of Yang's things to unlock Raven to begin with, right? Then Raven's third date. Just happens in the classroom. It's not even happening on date night. It doesn't happen. Okay. And then Penny's third slash fourth date thing happens just during nights. This is interesting. This is a different time because yeah, we've not really had this much before. It's always been like Saturday's date night. Saturday's where the event comes. Saturday's where you get the nice picture. That's twice now they managed to get a wee picture during the week. Hmm. That's of interest. I guess, well, I mean, I suppose, I guess, if they're bringing more and more girls and more and more events, you're not going to have enough weeks to do them all, no matter what, anyway. But I guess if it, this is a way of maybe making it so if you do certain events in certain ways, you can at least unlock extra few things throughout the weeks while doing the main dates you want to do as well. I get me. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just guessing. But right, that was Penny's thing. Back we go to there. There we are. Lovely, lovely. Yeah, so, um, Penny's thingy date. Penny's basically decided to beat to beat her machine side. But machine side basically... Machine side helped her function to get to grips of being human. Cool. Penny learned how to do all that stuff and control a machine by herself. Cool. The machine then took over Penny's ultimate combat semblance thingy. Right. The machine's now thinking, right, well, I can do this better. I can do all the other stuff you're doing. I'm just better. I'll take over. But Penny doesn't want that, obviously. So Penny's like, well, no. Actually, I'm just going to show you that I'm even better than you are. It's just a game of one-upping each other. I really hope Jin manages to seduce the machine side as well, though. I think if anyone can manage it, it'll be Jin. Like, the machine side, which possibly may have emotions, it may not. It, it just calculates what's the best Penny we can be. I hope Jin manages to seduce this as well. Because, <laughs> see, he seduces everything, doesn't he? Oh, God. I mean, it's going to make an appearance. Is this... I don't... It depends if this is the third or fourth date. If this is the third date, there's another event to go. If not, then the dance is the next thing for Penny. Which case, there'll be something going on. And that's where it will come to a head. Interesting. All right. This is a lovely wee Penny session. We just got to see nice bits with Penny. Penny's come a long way. She has. This game's shown her growing a bunch because she's been around mental people. Mental experiences. <laughs> lovely, lovely. That was a nice... That was a nice wee thing then. All right. Thank you all very much for watching in. Hope you all enjoyed the show. Uh, that's the third of the four dates I've got to do. Uh, next time we'll be doing Raven's fourth date, where... I don't even know what's happening anymore in Raven's. <laughs> I don't know what's happening, but I'm bloody loving it. So, yeah, I, I, I may or may not have just saved the best for last. It really depends what it is. If it can top the third date, then it, I've saved the best for last. Because White Rose was nice. It was fine. But it's still, it's still building itself up. The Penny stuff was lovely. But, again, building itself up is really coming to a head. Raven's one's just a laugh, though, isn't it? It's just broken. Because <laughs> you don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> oh, yeah. Get that for next time. Right. Thank you all very much for watching. Uh, link. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, links down below. If you want to play the game, this game's free to play. Uh, so, links down below. You can get the game to, in its, its, its latest version out. So, you have version 0 0.20 or 0 0.21. This is 0.21 I'm playing, which has this date added in and the Raven's fourth date. No. It has White Rose date and Raven's fourth date. This is part of 2 -0. Yes. Cool. Right, the bin. Right, thank you all for watching. See you next time for more Ruby Visual Novel. Go, bye everybody.
Da, 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 da. Also, just want to say a quick thank you to all of the channel members for the extra support and a special thank you and shout out to our elite members, the Johnny members, Dion, Evil Villager, Austin Quisenberry, Arkham Knight 400, Gren Gamer, Ice Prince Chris, Meat Locker Yeti, Onion, Leo Lalonde, and our Envy members, Epic Chris 07, Robert Simeca, Gold Dragon, Aragon, Crust, Shadow Wolf, and Marquis Moss. Thank you all very much for the extra awesome support. Battle, battle, battle.